Dude, I've heard you say the universe is expanding, but what is it expanding into? Okay, great question. Nothing. What? That's it? Well, yeah, I mean, the universe is by definition everything there is. So if it were expanding into something else, then that would just be a part of the universe too. I mean, I guess, but that still doesn't answer my question. You say that the universe is expanding, you know, getting bigger all the time. But where does all of this new space even come from? All right, think of it like this. The fabric of space-time itself is growing all the time, getting bigger and bigger. And this causes objects to be pulled further and further apart. And we know this because the further away we look, the quicker galaxies are moving away from us. Okay, that makes sense. But if it were expanding, surely it would have an edge, right? Like, could we take a spaceship and fly it to that edge and look out into nothingness? We aren't 100% sure, but as far as we can tell, the universe does seem to be geometric flat and infinite. This just means that you could fly away in a spaceship and never loop back around finding the Earth again. Wait, if the universe is infinite, surely that would mean there would be infinite copies of everything out there, including you and me. Exactly. Well, kind of. If the universe truly is infinite, which most cosmologists do believe it is, then in theory, everything should repeat itself. This means infinite versions of you. Maybe out there somewhere there's a version where you're seven foot tall, or maybe you're the next Einstein. This is the core of the paradox of an infinite universe, because everything we see here on Earth is made of a finite number of things arranged in a finite number of ways. So given infinite time and space, things will repeat. Okay, I think I need a nap. Good idea.